Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be looking at some league stuff coming to the Dragon Isles, so let's get into the video. Alright, so we have some new relics to look at that are going to be in the Dragon Isle, along with some gear that was updated, and they made it a lot better, so let's go ahead and look at it all. So we are going to start with the relics. So we have already seen the uh, Star Drakes, Galaxy Guardian, all of these. But they added some new elemental ones, like the Fire Relic, which does Fire Barrage. We also have the uh, Rift Ice Relic, which does Chill Splinter. The Rift Plant Relic, which does Bram Bramble Chain. And the, I think some of the uh, descriptions got updated as well. I'm not going to read this one. Uh, we got Rift Storm Relic. I think all of them... Pretty much all of them do, like, multiples except for Chill Splinter. And then we have the Rift Water Relic, which does three hits as well. So every single one of them do multiple hits. Um, so yeah, these were finally updated. So we'll go ahead and read those as well. Star Drake's Relic says, Pulsing with barely containing energy, this relic releases a bright flash of astral power on command. Galaxy Guardian's Relic, the unpredictable Astral Blast released from this relic are powerful but difficult to control. Mighty Worm's Relic, striking with force of Mighty Worm's Bite, this relic unleashes a powerful myth or physical spell. We still don't know who Mighty Worm is, we don't know who Star Drake is, we don't know who Terra Drake is. Terra Drake's Relic allows a wizard to unleash a fury of slashes striking all who get in the way. Terra Drake could be the physical dragon, but there are two of these, so it's kind of a little confusing. The Nightworm's Relic, empowered by Nightworm, this relic fires bolts of shadow at whoever the wizard wants. And then the Gloom Drake Relic says, the Gloom Drake's Relic grants a barrage of very powerful but unpredictable shadow blasts. So yeah, those are the relics. Let's go ahead and look at the boots as well. So none were added, but we can like see speed bonus. This one hasn't been updated, obviously. That's the Puppet Masters one. Uh, Mighty Worms has been updated to 330. Terra Drake's hoofs, 340. Terra Drake's boots, 330. Galaxy Guardians, 340. Um. Nightworms, 340, and Gloom Drakes, 330. So they aren't the best in the game, but they are very close to the level of the Duelist Blutes. So, yeah, they're pretty good. And then we can move on to the Wands, which are extremely good, I'm pretty sure. The Puppet Master's Wand, obviously, is 504. The Mighty Worms, Barb. Uh, does 360 now, but it's a dice spell, so it kind of sucks. Terra Drake's Claw, Body Slam, Power 370. Terra Drake's Mace, Power Bonus 360. Uh, Guardian's, or Galaxy Guardian's Rod, 370. Uh, 360. And then this one does 370. Uh, I'm not sure if the outfits were updated. I will go ahead and check. So, yeah, 330 and 340. This one's 330, this one's 340, 330, 340. And then I assume that's going to be the same for this as well. So, yeah, 340, 330, and yeah, I think, yeah. And then the Puppet Master stuff still has not been updated past their 270 yet. But yeah, that is really all there was added. I think, well, you can't see anything on this account. I was going to say that these got updated with newer damages. This account does not have uh, that update, so you can't see them. But yeah, the Dragon Isle should be coming out tomorrow for everyone. Hopefully we will get a bunch of the rewards added tomorrow, because it would be a little disappointing if we didn't get any of the other five dragons added tomorrow. 
But yeah, that is going to go ahead and end the video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe, and bye.